Welcome to Exhausted to Extraordinary, a mindset hack series with me, Dr. Sharon Grossman. Over the past two decades as a psychologist and success coach, I found that your mind is the most important tool you have to living life to the fullest. That's why I've dedicated this podcast to bringing you top experts and their key mindset tips, and I'm doing it in a rapid fire format. Here's what I mean. Each episode will be 10 minutes long and will feature an interview with experts in health, wealth, and relationships. Each guest will answer the same set of seven questions in seven minutes and share a free resource to jumpstart your success. To start us off, I decided to answer those same seven questions myself so you know a bit more about me and what I offer. The clock starts now. Question number one, what are the biggest challenges my ideal client faces? Well, I work with six-figure executives, entrepreneurs, and professionals in high-stress industries who are struggling with anxiety, overwhelm, and burnout, and want more than anything to regain the joy in their work and life. Question number two, what are the typical symptoms that they experience with that problem? Well, burnout is classified by a variety of symptoms, but the most prominent is exhaustion. In addition, they might notice their attitude becoming cynical and their performance declining. If they struggle with anxiety or overwhelm, they might find instead that their mind creates a lot of drama about the future, which makes them doubt their ability to be safe or succeed. This can negatively affect their confidence. And many of them experience imposter syndrome to begin with. So these emotional states might actually exacerbate the situation. Question number three, what are the common mistakes they make when trying to solve that problem? Well, the most common mistake I see when people are burning out is that they look for an exit strategy, like a job or career change. But what they discover too late is that they take themselves along for the ride. The same mind that created the stress or burnout is right there along with them. In other words, the answer doesn't lie outside of you. It is within you. But this is good news because it means you have more control than you realize. Question number four, what would an example of a transformation that is possible after this challenge is formally diagnosed B. Well, for my clients, this is an important question because too often they don't realize that they're burned out until it's too late. So part of the issue is proper diagnosis. But what is possible after that is that they can learn to manage their mind, their emotions, and their behaviors. This opens up so much opportunity for them to discover what they truly want and start questioning everything. I've seen clients increase the number of hours they sleep at night simply by minimizing their anxious thoughts. So your health can transform as well as literally every aspect of your life that's negatively affected by your mind. In fact, I named this podcast after my method, Exhausted to Extraordinary, which includes three steps to unblock your mind, reshape your thinking, and return the joy to your work in 90 days. And that's exactly how quickly you can expect to transform from burnout. Question number five, what's the number one mindset hack I could give my ideal client to solve that problem? Well, ask yourself, how do I want to feel? You likely can't change your circumstance, but you can change your thoughts about it. And once you identify what you want to feel, you can find a thought that leads to this feeling. So for instance, if you're worried, but want to feel calm, ask yourself, What would I need to think in order to feel calm in this situation? Question number six, what is one valuable free resource that I can direct people to that will further help them with that problem? Well, I created a free webinar, which you can find on my website, drsharongrossman.com, entitled The Three Mindset Hacks High Achievers Need to Avoid Burnout, which I recommend for anyone who's a perfectionist or who struggles with imposter syndrome, procrastination, or a negative mindset. Question number seven, what's one question I should have asked you but didn't that would give great value to our audience. Yeah. So the question I would add is what can people who want to coach themselves out of burnout do? 
Now, I spent two years compiling resources, which are now in my international bestselling book, The 7E Solution to Burnout. So I recommend they grab a copy and guide themselves through the process in seven easy steps. So there you have it. Seven questions in seven minutes. All future episodes will feature guests sharing their resources with you. So remember to subscribe so you don't miss a beat. I'll see you next time. Thanks for checking out the Exhausted to Extraordinary podcast. If you like what we do here, head on over to iTunes to subscribe, like us, and leave us a review. It is very much appreciated. And if you're feeling burned out and want to challenge yourself, Take the seven-day burnout to your best life boot camp. Go to sevendayburnoutchallenge.com to join for free.